Hi, and welcome to this tutorial on how to adjust opacity settings in Final Cut Pro 10. You can use the opacity for various effects. In this tutorial, we'll use it to create a drunken point of view. To begin with, you need to drag your clips into the timeline. In order to create a drunken point of view, we'll use the same clip twice. You start by dragging it into the timeline once, and then just place it on top of the other, slightly out of sync. Now when you play back this, it won't look like a drunken point of view. What you need to do is make the clips halfway opaque. You do that by marking the clip, scrolling down to the bottom, and just dragging this slider. Place it on 50. You can also just scroll down to the bottom and punch in the numbers. Remember to double click here type 50, and then when you play it back, it'll look like a drunken point of view. Now, since they're out of sync, they're not adjusted entirely on top of one of the other. In order to cut these small parts off easily, down here, just activate the Snap To function, press B on the keyboard in order to get the blade tool, make a cut, Press A in order to get your normal marking tool, and delete this. Press B again at the other end, cut this off, and there you have a drunken point of view.